I spoke with Zara Sendler's mother and father. They're heading into what they say will be their third straight sleepless night. I wish I knew that meant something. Sandra Cause says her daughter Zara Sendler hugged her extra tight before heading out the door Monday evening. She thought the 14 year old was heading to her friend's house just down the street, but realized something was wrong when the teen disabled the location services on her phone. Then she realized the teen's boyfriend was also missing. You know, and that's the hardest part. You know, they're both they're both sad and they're both just troubled kids that troubled in the way that they both have a lot of depression. And so when Zara says she doesn't feel safe, it's from herself. Zara's father says her friends tight lipped. We've had some some walls dealing with some of the friends trying to trying to protect Zara and, and Jesse at this point, but that's not what we need. We need them safe and their honesty. Joined by McQuanago police, the first lead they exhausted was the Vernon Marsh. Hours of searching turned up nothing. She leases a horse and I'm hoping that she knows that it matters to him too. Everybody wants her home safe and we want Jesse home safe too, but I'm just, you know, she's my baby. You certainly can feel for that family. So Kendall, what can people keep an eye out for? Joyce Zara's mom tells me both teens were wearing all black. I also reached out to the boy's family, but have not heard back.